had, I've had enough of sweeping. You're gonna be okay. These people are friends of mine, and I've explained to them this is your first time. But what if I do a crap job? You won't. Don't worry. And besides, Lisa and John are super understanding people. You'll be fine. Good luck! Didn't doubt you could, honey. Yes, you did. I heard it in your voice. Okay then. Hi, I'm Lisa. Lisa Bryce. Uh, this is my husband, John. We're here about the house. I can introduce myself, dear. Well, the moment has passed. You're just gonna have to suck it up. Hi, my name's Rita. It's nice to meet you. I'm here to show you around the house today. Uh, where's Becky? She's around. Becky just thought I could use some practice. Oh, that's right! You're the trainee! Oh, great. Uh, yes. And this is the house I'll be showing you today. Oh, it's so big! It's almost as big as the Kaplan's, isn't it? John? John! What? Kaplan's. Yeah. Well, let's start the tour. So first I want to show you the library, right beside the front door. Oh, how lovely! Uh, yes, oak paneling, rich carpet. I can just imagine this place as a sort of, uh, trophy room. Wouldn't you like that, John? A place to put all your trophies? I mean, trophy. Oh, Lisa, no. I insist we ought to use this room for your romance novel collection. All those crappy drugstore paperbacks ought to be proudly displayed right here in this little library. Uh, yeah, it is a lovely room. But here, you haven't seen anything yet. Look at this. <sighs> Look at that. It's just like a mystery novel. You'll have so much fun in that, John. You can show it to your secretary, that young pretty one. I bet you'd love that. Uh, moving on, I'll show you the main sitting room. What a lovely carpet. It'd be a shame to have to replace it like that last one. You know, wine stains are so hard to get out. I'm sure we could try this time. You are so fond of cleaning. Oh, but it's so spacious! Perfect for all those lively parties we'll throw with all your classy basketball friends. And your book club. And your secretary! So here's the kitchen. Very spacious. State-of-the-art dishwasher, oven, two-door refrigerator, and quartz countertops. Oh, good! My Lisa here just loves to cook. Always cooking she is. I can barely ever get her out of the kitchen. Oh yes, I just adore cooking for all of your friends. Well, you could just relax and watch basketball. Just whip up whatever your heart desires. I am happiest in the kitchen. And it really shows in your cooking. Uh, let's move on, shall we? Please! And here we have another sitting room. Perfect for a study or another library if you have some extra volumes. You do have a lot of romance novels. Shut up, John! And this is the nursery, with an extra room and bathroom, in case you want to expand the family. <laughs> no. And here we have the media room. It was just painted, and we just installed new skylights. Oh, what a shame! That means John can't have the full effect of his little man cave. It's not a man cave, it's my study. Study with a flat screen? Sure it is! It's not my fault that sometimes I like to unwind and get away from... From what? Uh, um... What? Go ahead, finish that sentence. Finish that little sentence that's on the tip of your tongue. I, I really don't think... You know, I can tell that you need some time alone. Reba and I will continue the tour and allow you to get acquainted with your future masturbation paper. It's Rita, actually. So, what's next on 
the tour. Well, you're actually leaving me currently. Oh, great. Where's the bathroom? Oh, it's back there. Splendid. Do you want me to show you the main features? The tiles Please are... don't. out of me for this house, you are gravely mistaken. Well, hold on a minute, John. Let's not be unreasonable. What do you mean, Lisa? Well, a murder has just occurred in this house. It probably won't sell very well, if at all. I see. Go on, dear. Well, it's, it's still a really nice house. Yeah, yeah. I see your point. Your friend just died in there! Yeah, but you know how you have friends and then you have friends? Becky was kind of a bitch. She really was. I'm glad we can agree on something. Oh my god! You killed her! Let's not jump to any conclusions here, Rhonda. I mean, it could have been you for all we know. Yeah, I mean, like, what were you doing, Lisa? I was just in the masturbation chamber this whole time. And I was just taking a pee. We were both pretty preoccupied, like... What were you doing? Seriously? Yeah, this is a serious deal, Rachel. Don't joke around. Do you think she could be using humor as a coping mechanism for her guilt? Probably. You're blaming me for this? Sweetie, we're not saying it was you, but... Mm. Yeah... This is fucking insane! I'm calling the police! John, get it! <sighs> Why'd you have to do that? That was very stupid of you, Rachel. Rachel, say you're sorry. Say, say you're sorry. Sorry. Rachel! Sorry! Good. How about we make this all go away, huh, Freya? Yep. Yeah. This is such a beautiful house. It's to die for. Half off. Half off? And we won't tell the cops about this little mishap you've committed. I didn't do anything! We don't know that for sure. The only one who does know is Becky. And she's dead! Shh, shh, shh. It's okay. It's okay. We'll just calm down. And we'll get through this together. Alright? Yeah, you're right. I've just got to calm down. I'm just going to take a breather in the, in the living room. I told you to 
to wash that stupid thing when you were done. I thought you were going to wash it. Why would I wash the knife my husband used to stab our real estate agent with? I don't know. You're the brains of this operation. I got the idea from one of my stupid romance novels, didn't I, John? It's not that hard. <sighs> you people are fucking insane, and you are going to prison. We're not exactly the ones with the knife. You just admitted to murdering Becky! But now I have photographic proof. Raina, are you sure people are gonna believe you now? <laughs> Do you wanna just forget all this happened? Help us bury the body? Tell everyone Becky just ran off? Give us the house half off? Rhonda? Rhonda? Rhonda. Reba. Rhonda. Rachel. Ricky, darling. Uh, Rhonda. Reba. Reba. Reba, honeycakes. Reba. Reba, darling. Rapunzel. Reba. Re Reba. Reba. The fuck, Reba. 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 My name is fucking Rita. I don't know. I'm glad. I'm happy to be here. I'll be upstairs putting some junk away. If you need a if you need a breather, just leave them upstairs and <laughs> John. John. What? We'll get through this together.